Streaming your cookie care is an intimate choice, but experts now have found out that this ad is a kind of misleading attempt at personal hygiene and um, with findings and you know advancement in science and all that it is said that shaving the public hair is unhygienic in this video i'll be explaining to you six reasons why you should not shave all of your public hairs so if this is a video you're interested in sit back relax and enjoy <music> YouTube channel. This is Nothing with Annie on your screen. I think we're well, Nothing Health Lifestyle Fit. If you're coming across this video for the first time, you are very welcome. <laughs> yes, you are very welcome. If you're coming across this video for the first time, if you're a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back to see what I have for you. And yeah, if you're not subscribed and you're watching this video, please subscribe. Hit the subscribe button. It is absolutely free. It will cost you nothing. Please subscribe. Like this video if you've watched to the end and you enjoyed the video. And share this video to your loved ones and family. Like I said, on today's video, I'll be telling you, giving you six reasons why you shouldn't shave all of your pubic hairs. I do not say you should not shave at all. Uh, <laughs> I, I wonder how down there will be looking if you leave that place and then you don't shave it at all. It's not like you're not going to shave it, but you are not supposed to shave everything. Like, are you team bald or are you team leave some hair? Let me know. <laughs> okay, yeah. So like I was saying, it's not like you're not going to shave your down there you are going to shave it but not everything you are going to leave some hair there and i'll be sharing with you six reasons why you should leave some hair in your pubic region so number one reason is that they are there for a purpose why i said they are there for a purpose is because they are actually there to serve a purpose being that that part of our body is kind of very sensitive and it is prone to rashes and itching and you know when you shave off the hairs that your public region especially for the females you begin to itch you begin to have some rashes and that's why i said they are there for a purpose they are there to keep that place warm and moist yeah because you also sweat in your public region if you don't know now you know so they are they are there for a purpose and that is why you should not shave all of them the reason is that they help to prevent bacteria and infections from entering into your vagina like when we when it comes to our nose you notice you have hairs in your nose and these hairs help to filter out bacteria help to filter out dead same as the ones in your public region they help to prevent you know infections and bacteria from getting directly into your vagina so yeah they act as a barrier that is why you should not shave all of it emphasis on all of it i did not say don't shave at all don't go and say ha nothing with and you said don't shave your public region at all that is not what i'm saying what i'm saying is you shave your public region but not all of it yeah so this is number two reason it serves as a barrier against bacteria and infection three is it to prevent itching you remember like when you when you shave at first you feel very fresh and you know free but you notice that as the day as the day goes by you begin to itch on the streets you are itching in your room you are itching in the class you are itching anywhere you find yourself your hands are always going towards that direction why because you have shaved and made that place that place so empty so it is like i said in my in the previous point i gave i said um they are um, that part of our body is very sensitive and they are prone to you know itching and rashes so when you shave all of it you begin to eat and you cannot imagine how uncomfortable that is so number this is number three reason why you shouldn't shave all of your pubic region one reason is to prevent ingrown hair when you shave all of your pubic region ingrown hair tends to be there and that can lead to black hair in your pubic region and when you look at it you notice that there are some discoloration this kind of blackish color in some parts of your pubic region reason is because ingrown hair you know is affecting it so yeah this is another reason why you shouldn't shave all of your pubic region 
emphasis on all of it. <laughs> emphasis. I know I'm emphasizing on all of it so that you will not go and say I said you should not shave at all and then you leave that place so bushy. No, it's not going to be nice. But if you if you are shaving your pubic region, don't shave all of it. A fifth reason why you shouldn't shave all of your pubic region is because it maintains the vaginal the temperature around your vagina. Reason is because just like the way you sweat in other parts of your body, you also sweat in the pubic region and the sweat tends to keep that place, you know, the, the, it, it tends to keep that, the temperature of that area normal. So this is another reason why you shouldn't shave all of your pubic hair. Not the least is that it reduces the transmission of STDs. Disclaimer, there is no foolproof to this. But like I said earlier, the hair helps to trap bacteria and some of these STDs are bacterial infections and before they can get into your body, the hair will serve as a barrier. But like I said, there is no foolproof to this, but this is another reason why you shouldn't shave all of your pubic hairs. Yeah, I've come to the end of this video. I hope this I hope this video was helpful. If you enjoyed this video to the end, give it a like, give it a thumbs up, share this video to your friends and family, and drop a comment, leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you feel about shaving your pubic hairs. Yeah, I want to know, I want to hear your own views, I want to see your views about how you feel when it comes to shaving the pubic area both men both women how do you guys feel do you feel like everything should be shaved off or do you feel like some should be left or do you feel like don't even shave at all what are your opinions yeah so i've come to the end of this video thank you for watching up to this moment and i'll see you in my next video till then bye